We're in the basic culinary arts kitchen. This is the first stop you make during your nine month program here at ACI. Um, this is where we build your foundation. We're gonna take you for six weeks. We're gonna show you so many of the basic fundamentals that you're gonna actually spend um, building the rest of your education on and building the rest of your career on. Uh, we do everything from teach you how to hold your knife and the proper way to carry yourself as a professional all the way through knife cuts. Uh, we cover vegetable cookery, salad making, a variety of starches. We do potato cookery, we do rice and polenta, we do fresh and dried pasta cookery where we get a chance to actually make fresh pasta dough, cook some dry pasta and look at the two side by side. Uh, we do a lot of that here, trying to really do hands-on so you can actually see the differences. It's more than just talking about it or concepts or ideas, but we actually want to you know, have you taste and touch and execute all these different things so you know the difference between A and B. From that point we spent an entire week going over stocks and sauces. Um, the stocks are the foundation of any kitchen. Um, at that point we roll into soup cookery the next week. Everything from cream soups and puree soups up to the very exquisite consomme. Um, after that we do three days of what's probably my favorite part of the entire class is fish and shellfish cookery. Uh, we go over lobsters and shrimp and clams, oysters, mussels, uh, we're going to cover bass, flounder, salmon, and the nice thing is even in basics you're getting your hands on all these products. You're opening oysters, you're steaming mussels, um, you're going to get a chance to actually break down your own flounder and your own striped bass and then not only break it down but actually take it and cook it in a variety of different ways. Um, at that point we're going to roll into doing poultry, you're going to break down chickens, learn to tie them, truss them, we're going to go into red meats, pork, we do a couple different types of lamb, going to do beef in a variety of ways and along the path you're going to be learning all these different cooking methods you know pan frying, deep frying, sauteing, grilling, roasting. Um, then the last week is kind of fun it's basically a week of practical application. We want to test you, we want to see what you've learned in the first five weeks here and then kind of the, the grand finale if you will, the graduation from basics class is we're actually going to cook breakfast for the entire school and I just think that's awesome because that's all in the first six weeks during your time here. You couple that with the fact that half of our day is spent in the kitchen, the other half of the day is in the classroom. In the classroom, we're going over the theory of the food. Uh, we're discussing the recipes. We're discussing the ideas behind where all these techniques come from. So by the time we actually hit the kitchen, we've discussed the theory, we've gone over a recipe, then we come into the kitchen, you watch me make that product. After I make it, you taste it, and everybody has to taste everything, then you actually dig in and make it yourself. So you've talked about it, seen it, tasted it, and then you actually do the hands-on practical application. And it's that total immersion in what we do that I think is what really helps us benefit. Um, if you look around the basics kitchen, you notice how spacious it is. All of our kitchens are designed to comfortably hold 20 people. I can tell you from about five years now of teaching here, you've got plenty of space, you've got all the room you need to move around, and you get a lot of my personal attention. Um, everybody excels at different levels, so if you're the average student, you know, progressing at an average speed, the program's gonna be perfect for you. But what if you're having trouble? What if you're struggling a little bit? Well, I get a chance to notice this, and I can pull you aside and provide you with extra time after school. We can work one-on-one, -on -one, and I'm gonna do everything I can to make sure you get caught up to the level you need to be at. What about the other end of that? What if you're an advanced student? I can notice that as well, so I can push you just a little bit harder um, to make sure that you're really benefiting. And it's that small family atmosphere that's what draws me here as an instructor. I tell students all the time, whether they're students that are in the school or students that are just taking a tour, this is the only school in the state I would even consider working at. I believe in the product we put out, and I believe in the program that we execute here, and I absolutely love the work that we get a chance to do with our students. It's a great job, it's a great program, and um, that all really starts here in the basic culinary arts kitchen.